Okay, in a previous video I talked about capping or capturing ships and we did that through uh, firing weapons at the ship and dropping their shields very quickly in hopes that the pilot would bail. That's one way to capture. Um, the other way that everyone talks about, and I'm sure you've heard, is boarding. And that is where you have marines um, on your ship or a ship actually board uh, the enemy ship. They cut through the hull, They're, they fight their way from deck to deck. Um, and then eventually hopefully hack into the ship's computer and take it over. So you're gonna need to, f well I guess I should say there's two ways to do this. First of all, um, if you have an M7M ship like a Cobra, you can actually uh, bring the shields down very quickly, especially larger ships um, with flail and, and uh, hammer missiles. Um, and then you fire the Marines in a boarding pod towards the ship. Um, the other way is to launch them and do a spacewalk. And uh, that's what we're going to be doing in this video tutorial. So, first thing you need is a TP, a ship that can haul um, people, has life support. I've already picked up an Argon Express. And uh, you'll buy Marines from military outposts and training barracks. Now, not all of them sell Marines, and not all of them train Marines, so you may have to find, uh, shop around until you find that. Um, another point of, um, that I should mention is you definitely want to have, among the trade extension and our trade software, you definitely want to have a bioscanner on the ship, um, because with this, I'll show you in just a minute. Um, if we open up the trade menu with the outpost, you'll see that, among other items, uh, there are Marines available here and there are varying prices. And because I have the bioscanner installed, uh, the marine that I have selected, I can actually see their skill level and how many stars they have. Um, you know, one to five stars, definitely the more the better. Um, all of these skills, engineering, mechanical, hacking, um, these can be trained in outposts, but you cannot do that with fighting. The only way to increase fighting is actually running boarding ops and uh, you know, preferably successfully. Um, so, the point is, is you want to buy your Marines with the highest amount of fighting skill to start with because that's the hardest thing to train. Um, so we're going to scan through here real quick because I have the bioscanner again. Oh, there's one with four stars. We're definitely going to grab, grab that one. Mercenary bought. And uh, scan through real quick to see if, no, we're not that lucky. I'm going to go ahead and grab the two star Mercenary Marines in fighting. Bought. Mercenary. That bought. gives us a total of three, and so I'll go ahead and grab Mercenary the ones. Mercenary. Now, of course, if you're uh, really bought. trying to be successful at this, you can um, shop around, look around uh, as many places as you can, and get the absolute best Marines you can find right up front as far as uh, their fighting skill goes. Okay, now we have some Marines, and you want to know how to train them. So, again, my Express is docked at a military outpost that will let me train. Um, you open up the trade menu like we just did and now it looks a little different because it shows the marines that I have uh, at that station here and basically you just select one of the marines and it gives you an option of what you want to train let's say if I want to train hacking there's three different ways quick normal and advanced and of course uh, the higher you go the more it costs but the more um, the more training is conducted I don't know the exact math. You can dig into that on the forums if you wish. Uh, but I basically never waste time with quick training. I just go straight to advanced. Um, at the very beginning, um, I also don't waste time unless I'm specifically, you know, I just need a couple of Marines who are better at hacking, um, which isn't the case when you're generally starting out because you're just buying your first Marines. I will train all skills. And again, you know, quick, normal, and advanced, and you can see that's very expensive very quick. So I'm going to set these guys training, and um, actually I'm not going to do that for the video. I'm not sure what I have in my account here with this script. Training. Okay, I've got him set to train all skills. I can go through here and uh, set the other four to do that. Um, and for starting out, I mean, you probably want to have um, one or two stars at least in... Um, um, each of the areas you want to have at least a marine capable of doing that um, just a real quick overview of course fighting basically uh, the boarding process once you get them to the ship um, they are going to try to get through the hull 
which yeah, that's their mechanical skill. Um, they're going to fight their way from deck to deck, and that's the fighting skill. And once they get to the central core of the computer of the ship, they'll try to hack into it. Um, and if they're successful, uh, the ship is yours. Uh, engineering, to the best of my knowledge, basically uh, lowers the amount of damage your Marines do to the ship while they're fighting their way through it. So uh, definitely something you want to have on all, all of them. Um, all right, that's the very basics and introduction in setting up um, your gear. And when I come back in the next video we're going to try to capture an M6 uh, using this express and um, I'll show you how I do it. I'm sure there's other ways but um, this is how I've been able to be successful. So I hope this will help and I'll see you in the next video.